Hey, what's up, y'all? It's uh, your boy, Red Pill Life. Changed my name since the last time we talked. But uh, I haven't posted in a while, you know? Shit's been crazy. You know how it goes. But um, I've been meaning to get back on here and make videos for y'all. But, um, you know, I was talking with a young family member. He's a automotive technician. He makes decent money. And this this kid is is pretty skilled at working on cars, I'd say. Um, and but for some reason, this dude does not want to work on cars in his free time in order to make some more money. But he has all these goals and aspirations, so it's like, I mean, yeah, you got to do shit for money sometimes, just to finance your long term goals, you know. Um, you know, do whatever you can to make as much as you can. That's my philosophy. Because, I mean, everybody's like, monetize your hobbies, but, you know, I mean, if you don't maximize your income, then how are you going to do that? Um, and I mean, even if you don't have a passion, at least make as much money as you can to finance your investments like stocks, index funds, real estate, etc., you know, until you find your passion. And even if you don't, then you have a nice little nest day with some, hopefully some positive cash flow coming in every month. Because one thing I noticed about my hobbies is I want to monetize them. I want to start making money off of them, but they cost money, you know? Like one of my things is I love koi. But to get the nice koi, they actually cost a lot, dude. And you can't get them in the States, really. You got to go to Japan. That's where the good fucking koi are. But they cost a lot of money, dude. Like the most expensive koi sold a few years ago, probably the last time I made a video around that time, the most expensive koi, one koi sold for like $1.8 million or some crazy shit like that. Um, so the point of my video is make that money, man. Do what you got to do, even if it's something that you hate. If it's something that you're good at and it's something that pays, like working on cars, for example. And I even tried to convince this dude. I'm like, dude, why don't you go work on BMWs, dude? Because everybody knows BMWs are POSs. No hate on the people that actually drive BMWs. But, dude, everything is made of plastic and they're European. And if you take them to a actual, like, if you take them to the BMW dealer, dude, you'll get raped with how much they charge you. But if you take them to a BMW mechanic that only works on, like, European cars, dude, it's fucking expensive. But that's where the money's at. And, you know, I, I've tried to talk to him multiple times. And I guess because he's young and he thinks he knows everything and, you know, people are like, don't chase money. But it's like you need money to do things, like, whatever. But, um... Thought I'd make a quick little video on this. Uh, bottom line is, dude, don't do things for money, but you need money to do things. Bottom line. Money doesn't buy you happiness, but name somebody who doesn't have money that's happy. I promise you there's hardly any. So uh, hopefully I didn't go on too long. A quick little rant. Um, you know, hopefully I'll start posting more and more. I think I will. But uh, I guess I'll see you guys later. Red Pill Life out.